Welcome to our channel. When is Coco Goff's next match at 2024 US Open? Time, TV schedule vis Emma Navarro. Coco Goff continues her run to repeat as US Open champion today. It was a close call though, as the Delray Beach native dropped the first set of her third round match against Alina Svetolina on Friday. The 20-year-old tennis superstar rallied to advance to today's round of 16 against fellow American Emma Navarro, who defeated Goff at Wimbledon in July. Goff is the no-3 seed in the U.S. Open, while Navarro is the no-13 seed. Goff has been on a slump recently after making three straight Grand Slam semifinals. She bowed out of Wimbledon in the round of 16 and hasn't gotten farther than that since. Goff lost in the third round of the 2024 Olympics Women's Singles Tournament, and most recently lost her first match in the Cincinnati Open. Coco Goff rallied from a set behind to beat Alina Svetolina 3-6, 6-3, 6-3 in the third round of the U.S. Open on Friday. Goff had won her first two U.S. Open matches in straight sets, beating Varvara Gracheva 6-2, 6-0 before sweeping to Gina Maria 6-4, 6-0. Coco Goff was born March 13, 2004, in Atlanta, but she grew up in Delray Beach, Florida. She trained at Pompey Park, the same facility that Venus and Serena Williams honed their craft before taking over the tennis world two decades ago. We occasionally recommend interesting products and services. If you make a purchase by clicking one of the links, we may earn an affiliate fee. USA Today network newsrooms operate independently, and this doesn't influence our coverage. Coco Goff's U.S. Open title defense is over after she was beaten by Emma Navarro in the fourth round in New York. Third seed Goff produced a disjointed performance to lose 6-3, 4-6-6-3 to fellow American and 13th seed Navarro. Goff hit 19 double faults, including 11 in the third set alone, and produced three in the final game of the match to hand Navarro victory. I lost in the first round the last two years and now to be making the quarterfinals is pretty insane, said Navarro. This is the city I was born in, and it feels so special to be playing here. Goff was comprehensively beaten by Navarro just two months ago in the last 16 at Wimbledon. She said she would need to maintain her focus after collapsing mentally in their previous meeting, but frailties on serve, including three back-to-back -back double faults in the third set, and 60 unforced errors helped Navarro reach the quarterfinals at Flushing Meadows for the first time. Navarro will go on to play 26 